Hello, I'm Rick Streaker. In this segment of the Packard Academy, we'll be discussing selecting the right transformer. When looking at transformers, you can see a lot of differences between each of them. In the first transformer, there are only four leads, two on each side of the coil. In the second transformer, there are five leads on one side, two leads on the other side. And on the third transformer, we have four leads on one side, four leads on the other side. Yet functionally, the third transformer can be used to replace the first transformer. The second transformer can be used to replace the first transformer as well. But there are different features to each of these. This particular transformer has an auto reset protector in it. The third transformer has a fuse on a common line to protect it against overloads. Let's look at each one of these and determine the specifics about it and how to determine which transformer to use in an application. The first transformer is rated 120 volts primary and 24 volts secondary. The primary voltage is with the white common and the black connected to your power source, which is, in this case is 120 volts. The primary leads, the primary coil, is what goes to the power source, the source of power coming out of the wall to energize this transformer. The secondary coil, in this case, is 24 volts. And the secondary coil then provides 24 volts to the appliances, to the thermostat, to the contactor, to different products that need to be sourced by that low voltage. So the primary is the power coming out of the main power source, out of the wall. The secondary is the power then going to the additional apparatus that you attach. The second transformer can also be used on primary voltage of 120. But in addition to that, the secondary transformer is suitable for 208 volts, 240 volts, and 480 volts. So this particular transformer is not only capable of converting from the 120 volts, but you can use it for multiple voltages. So it's a very versatile transformer. Now these types of transformers are more expensive, but it's a great transformer to be able to carry on the truck for multiple applications that you might, might see. On the transformer, this one is classified as a 50 VA transformer. That's 50 volt amps. The first transformer was a 40 volt amp transformer. So in addition to matching the voltages, it's important to match the load that the secondary voltage will be carrying. This particular transformer on secondary voltage is 24 volts. So for the primary voltages, utilizing it on 120 volt, we connect the white lead to one side of the power, and we connect the black lead to the other power lead. To operate on 208 volts, connect the white and the red to the power. For 240 volts, we connect the white and the orange to the power. And for 480 volts, the white and the gray to power. 
again, this particular transformer gives us multiple primary voltages. Again, the primary voltage is the source of power that we apply to this, but it gives us a single secondary voltage, 24 volts. This transformer also has a protector so that if the load exceeds the rating of this, it will automatically trip and protect the transformer from, from burning up. The third transformer is also a very versatile transformer. It has primary voltages of 120, 208, and 240 volts. Unlike the second transformer, it also has multiple secondary voltages. The secondary voltages are 2.5 volts, 12 volts, and 24 volts. To use the different voltages on the secondary, the blue would be the common. To use this for 2.5 volts, we would use the blue and the white lead. To connect this for 12 volts, we'd use the blue and the black lead. To connect for 24 volts, we would use the blue and the yellow lead. This also has protection to prevent against overloading. This protection is with a fuse that is connected in line on the common line of the secondary. So again, very versatile. By carrying this on your truck, rather than the first transformer that was strictly 120 volt primary, 24 volt secondary, it gives you the option of using it on multiple primary voltages and for multiple secondary voltages. Please visit our website www.packardonline.com for additional training opportunities.